Pythagorean Theorem for Babies by Chris Ferry and Mike Zanidi. This is a ball. It has no corners and no sides. This is a square. It has four corners and four sides. Squares can be any size as long as the sides and corners are the same. The big square is made of nine smaller squares. This is a rectangle. It has four corners that are the same, but the sides are different. This rectangle is made of twelve squares. This is a triangle. There are many kinds of triangles. They all have three corners and three sides. This book is about a special triangle, a right triangle. Cut a rectangle in half and get two right triangles. A right triangle has a square corner. To square a side of a triangle is to make a square with the same size side. Count the red blocks, the green blocks, and the blue blocks. 9 plus 16 equals 25. The number of red and green blocks is the same as the number of blue blocks. The Pythagorean theorem says this is true for every right triangle. Here's another way to prove it. Start with the square of the triangle's longest side. Each side of the blue square is the same size as the longest side of the yellow triangle. Cut the blue square into four equal triangles. The blue and yellow triangles are the same size. Swap the top two blue triangles with the bottom two yellow triangles. The size of the blue area has not changed. The original green square fits perfectly over this part of the blue area. And the original red square fits perfectly over the rest of the blue area. You just proved the Pythagorean Theorem.